there will be no furloughs. You can take that to the bank. And the people of Puerto Rico must be assured that there is only one government in the island. And that government is led by Ricardo Rosselló. The implementation of this furlough program must result in a net savings of at least $218 million for the fiscal year 2018. To meet the gap in right-sizing initiatives, this would represent up to a two-day per month furlough for all government employees with the exclusion only of frontline police and only for the period from September through the end of fiscal year 2018. And that is what I have been told by everybody involved, I and think, I would I appreciate... Christian, Christian, sorry, the, the issue there, isn't the, the I would forecast, like, it, is, it was the forecast. It was the forecast. I would just like my turn to ask questions and not have them interrupted. Uh, can you tell me, Executive Director, do you think, in your opinion, that the senior leadership of the government of Puerto Rico now is committed to comply with the fiscal plan and to right-size government. Mr. Sabrino, you just announced a pension policy that's in conflict with the fiscal plan, so I unfortunately have to say that, you know, today you said you would, you would not comply with the fiscal plan. But with the, with the right-sizing of government, do you agree that we have, are committed? I believe that you have commitment, but, I, yes. but you have not complied with the fiscal plan in terms of the submission of, of implementable plans by the date. The board wishes today to decree and to impose a furlough program to the employees of the government of Puerto Rico. The fact that no agency of the government was provided a turn to counter-present a Ms. Jaresko's presentation underlines this concern. And to be clear, the government, its officials, and myself are still and continue committed to working with the board and to meet our targets in the fiscal plan. But Mr. Chairman, today on this issue of furloughs, the government understands that the line needs to be drawn. There will be no furloughs. You can take that to the bank. And the reasons for that are many. The first reason is that the public and the people of Puerto Rico must be assured that there is only one government in the island, and that government is led by Ricardo Rosselló. The government of Puerto Rico is committed to right-sizing. The, the governor ran on a platform of right-sizing that predates the board and predates the enactment of PROMESA itself. The government will meet its, meet its fiscal, fiscal goals, but under the policy established by the government itself, consistent with the fiscal plan. Mr. Chairman, we will right-size the government of Puerto Rico because we want to, and because we need to for the good of Puerto Rico, not because of the menace of an ultra vires imposition. Again, I must reiterate the position, repeat the position of the governor of Puerto Rico. There will be no furloughs. And although we may have a contentious discussion on this effect, please rest assured that our commitment to cooperate in all other efforts remains intact. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Sobrino.